Welcome to another video. So today uh, we're going to go off topic here and we're going to talk about what I don't want to talk about. Okay, and it's regarding my hair transplant. Okay, now you're probably wondering what happened to those videos that you made, Justin, a few years ago about your hair transplant journey and uh, why you don't talk about it anymore. Well, I'll tell you why. Okay, so uh, for those of you who don't know, I went to Korea a few years ago and I got a hair transplant and blah, 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 and got my hair restored in the front. So I documented the whole journey from start to finish, and uh, yeah, I was done. I was done with the whole series. Okay, I wrapped it up. There's not much else I can say about you know my experience because it was, it's done. Okay, I got my hair back. But here's what happened after I made those videos. I kept getting bombarded by guys who had a similar situation every day i kept getting emails and messages from guys asking the same freaking questions to me crying and whining com complaining to me about their hairline and blah 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 justin can you help me and blah, 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 i want your help help me help me and i was like my god i Put those videos out there for you guys so that you can do it yourselves. That's the reason I made those videos. But I kept getting the same messages, same emails, same questions every day. I got tons of these and I was just so fed up. The information was laid out in those videos. It was right there. Where I went to get my hair transplant, how to contact them, you know, what, what happens after you pay and you go from start to finish and the results after. I mean, it's it's plain and simple, but guys just don't get it. And I was just like, my God, they are just, these guys are just so weak. Life favors the bold, not the beggars, okay? I don't like having beggars surrounding me asking me the same questions. So that's the reason why I just like, I stopped everything. I like, okay, I'm gonna get rid of all these videos. I'm going to wipe it out, okay? Because I'm just tired of people harassing me about, you know, them going bald and their hairline and hair transplant and asking the same goddamn questions every day. For you, you're like, oh, what's wrong, Justin? You know, what's wrong with helping people? I helped a few people out in the beginning. And then, you know, guess what? You know, I, I helped them for free and they just wasted my time, right? Because they didn't do anything. They just asked, kept asking questions and then they didn't do anything. And it happened again and again and again. And I was like, this is stupid. This is a waste of my time. I don't want to be doing this for the rest of my life. So that's why I don't talk about my hair transplant anymore. But uh, you know what? Since I made those videos, I might as well just keep them up, you know, for future people to, to look at and just help them out. But if you want my help, don't ask for it because I'm not going to help you, okay? The information's laid out in those videos. And I don't want anyone emailing me or messaging me about their hairline, complaining and crying and all that. From this whole experience, I've learned that, you know, even if you try your best intentions to help people, there are people out there who will take advantage of it. And that's just a sad fact. So here, here's another thing that I thought to myself. The world is full of a lot of weak men, okay? There's a lot of weak men in this world, People, men who are just too afraid to take action, all right? Like me, all right? It wasn't easy, but I did it anyways. I got on a plane, I flew to Korea, I went to the hair transplant clinic, I got it done, I recovered. A few months later, boom, my hair went back to normal, right? That's what I did. Was I scared? Yes, I was. Of course, it's the unknown, but... You know, if I didn't do it, then I would just live a whole life of regret. So here's my thoughts. I'm going to make a second channel just for men. Self-improvement for men. Okay. Uh, I haven't thought of the name yet, but uh, click the link down below to check it out. There's no content on it yet, but I'm going to make some topics on, you know, how to be a stronger man in 2022. Because I think there's a lot of weak men around me. 
I've noticed this everywhere I go, wherever I am in the world. I don't know. It's just something that it's been on the back of my my mind lately. How am I going to help these guys out based on my experience in life? Click the link down below and uh, oh yeah, I got an Instagram. I got that back up. I'll tell you why I didn't use Instagram for many years. So click that link down below as well. Check it out. Tell me what you want to see in my Instagram because I'm, you know, I'm back to basic. I'm starting from bare bones. So check those links out down below. Thanks for watching. My name's Justin and bye.